Okay, so you want a consistent web part you can add to all site pages that shows uh, the recognition app. Okay. And you also want to be able to future proof it so I can like add other things to that and it would also automatically appear like a dashboard. Okay. Well, you're in luck because Microsoft just released a new dashboard web part that is integrated and it updates automatically and it's super slick. Stick around, we're gonna show you all about it. I'm a SharePoint expert, play with data extra. Careful with my hands, cause I gotta use them forward. All right, let's get that timer rolling, y'all. All right, first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go into the gear icon for the site and you're gonna go down to manage dashboard. If it's a home site, it's gonna say like manage Viva connections or something like that. Anyway, so you're gonna go ahead and create that dashboard if you never have before. And this is gonna be for the entire site. So we're going to click on create and now we can populate that bad boy with cards. So we're going to add in the recognition. That was the request. I know it's in here somewhere. I swear to goodness, where it at? Where is it? There it is. Praise. All right, cool. So we have the one card and then we're just going to go ahead and publish that bad boy. We're just publishing the dashboard at this point. Now we're going to add the dashboard web part to the home page and we can add it to all other pages if we want. So we're going to edit mode on the page. And we're going to go in and we're going to just add a new section, one column, and then we'll add a web part. And it is a dashboard type right there. Boom, dashboard. And it is the dashboard. And we republish. And we did it. Now we can add this to any page that we want. And if we update that dashboard in the background, it's going to automatically update on the page without us having to go back and re-add the web part. That is super slick. All right. So let's slow it down and talk about what's going on here in the background. And while we're at it, I want to thank you so much for the support. Please take a minute. If you like anything that you see here today, please like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell notification. So let's rock and roll. Okay, so it's this new dashboard web part. And there's all these cards you can add to the dashboard. And when you add cards, it updates wherever that dashboard's being used. So thing to keep in mind is this dashboard is per site. Per site. So you can have different dashboards for different sites. It does not run across different sites. So again, how do we manage that? Well, we're going to go into the gear icon for the site, go to settings, and we're going to go to manage dashboard. And there's some information, learn more, blah, 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 blah. Okay. We're going to hit edit and we're going to see that one card. It's the praise card. I called it recognition earlier. Praise recognition, potato, potato. All right. And let's say we want to add another card. So we go and edit the dashboard and we add another card. Let's say we want to add something in that shows people like their frequent sites. So we can go to my sites and it will show them their frequent sites. Maybe you want people to be able to get to their OneDrive on the web fast. So there is a OneDrive. I know that there it is OneDrive. And you can also edit how their how the layout is, you know, large, small. You can explore clicky clicky all that happy stuff. Now I'm going to republish this and I'm going to go back to the home page and you're going to see these web parts are now going to be on that dashboard. So there you go. See? Now, I don't know how you're going to use this. You know, you might want to just, you know, have some consistency across sites or across site pages rather, right? So if I go into um, another page that is on this site, let's see if I can see, do I have any other pages here? Do I have some pages? I mean, there's the dashboard page, but I didn't, let's create a new page, a new site page. Okay. And we're just going to show you here that it is not necessarily an automatic thing. See, it's not on here, right? But I have this new page. Okay. We'll call it new page. I know very unique. And then we're going to add in just go look for that dashboard, which it's down here and under advanced and you'll see it's pre-populated. You publish the puppy and you're rocking and rolling. So there you go. Hopefully this will help you add some consistency to your site and help people get to the things that you want them to see. With that, do the very best you can with what you got. Remember, SharePoint rocks, and so do you. We'll see you next time. I'm a SharePoint expert, play with data extra. Careful with my hands, cause I gotta use them forward. Yeah, I'm a big old nerd. I like maple syrup. All my pancakes, I don't care what you heard.